Welcome to the Cathedral of Saints Peter and Paul in Ennis in County Clare in the Diocese of Killaloo. For a long number of decades, there has been a great uh, prayer devotion to Matt Talbot uh, in many of the parishes in, in the diocese, particularly in the parish of Shannon and Kilrush, and also in Tulla, where every Lent there is a special novena devoted uh, praying to Matt Talbot and for many people who are suffering from addictions of one sort or another. A very interesting initiative about to be launched in the cathedral here is one of the parishioners of Ennis, uh, a lady called Noreen Flynn, was commissioned to design a, a painting specifically on the various transition points and high points of the life of uh, Matt Talbot. As you can see, born in 1856, uh, became destitute because of his addiction to alcohol. Unfortunately, uh, fell foul of the life of thievery, stole a violin and a number of other things, but reached an interesting conversion point in his life when he went to Clonliffe and took the Pioneer Pledge. And that was a huge transformation point in him. And later then, he became very devout in terms of his faith. And with the advice of the priest in Clonliffe, he read the lives of the saints and St. Augustine's Confessions uh, and also the life of St. Francis de Sale and his various works and was a great devotee of the Eucharist and Our Lady and the Rosary and was very devoted to the life of charity and helped the missions and so on and made a great go out of his life after a very shaky start. What a great role model for so many to be able to uh, focus on and to pray to uh, and to have as, uh, as a focus of somebody that can rise up out of the ashes of challenges and difficulties. And for so many people, and especially at this challenging times who might be addicted to whether it's alcohol or drugs or uh, whatever it might be, uh, Matt Talbot is, is indeed a great role model. For so many people, the Pioneer Association uh, is a huge help. And during this month of November, uh, it's a huge thing for people to go online and look at the temporary pledge that the pioneers offer, or maybe even the full-time pledge. I commend that uh, to anybody uh, for whom that might be a positive thing to do. I'll finish with a prayer to Matt Talbot, which will be at the bottom of what will be the shrine at the door of the cathedral here in Ennis, and it runs as follows. Lord, in your servant Matt Talbot, you have given us a wonderful example of triumph over addiction, of devotion to duty, and of lifelong reverence for the most holy sacrament. May his life of prayer and penance give us courage to take up our crosses and follow in the footsteps of our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ. Father, if it be your will that your beloved servant should be glorified by your church, make known by your heavenly favours the power he enjoys in your sight. And we ask this through the same Jesus, our Lord. Amen. Matt Talbot, pray for us.